now we shall discuss about the types of vegetations the types of vegetations the first major one what we have is the tropical evergreen forest the tropical evergreen forest is a very commonly found in our country in the regions of western ghats in the lakshadweep and the andaman and nicobar islands some parts in the upper parts of assam region and also we find it in the coast of tamil nadu now moving on to understand as a name itself it suggests that the trees here are always green so the tropical evergreen forest receives very heavy amount of rainfall accounting for about 200 cm of rainfall per annum and here this is a common phenomena that here we receive very heavy rainfalls and uh, moving on to the regions where it is present it is present in the western ghats of india all the islands like andaman and the lakshadweep islands and we also have in the states like assam and the tamil nadu regions where the presence of tropical evergreen forest is present we have the animals like elephants monkey lemur horned rhinoceros and deer are also found many types of monkeys are also found in this forest and moving on to understand why it is known as an evergreen forest the forest which do not shed their leaves are known as evergreen forest generally plants have a tendency of shedding down their leaves at a particular season so here the tropical evergreen forest has no definite time when the trees shed their leaves that's the reason why most of the times you have completely green cover in the forest and very few of the trees will shed their leaves so that's why it is known as tropical evergreen forest another specialty of the tropical evergreen forest is the trees grow as tall as 60 meters and above which also has different layers so it gives the combination of multi layer of the trees and these multi layers are like trees shrubs and creepers joining together and all these things where the, even the sun rays find it difficult to go into the reach the land where these forests are present so and the precious wood what we get here is the mahogany ebony and the rose wood and in some parts we also get the sandal wood here we also need to understand that we have a wide variety of birds are also present in the evergreen forest so the evergreen forests have certain features like they receive heavy rainfall accounting up to 200 cm of the annual rainfall and they have the animals like elephants monkey lemur horned rhinoceros deer varieties of the monkeys various kinds of birds present there they are located in the western ghat region islands of andaman and the nicobar while in the assam and the tamil nadu region they also have the precious wooden trees like mahogany ebony rosewood and the trees in this region grow very tall like about 60 meters and they also have trees shrubs and creepers which create a multi layered structure there and there is no definite time for the trees to shed their leaves so there is no particular season where the trees will shed down their leaves so that is the reason why it is rightly and appropriately known as the tropical evergreen forest if you like this video please give a thumbs up please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on cbse syllabus